there's a lot of competition and contests out there. You have your sporting events, you have beauty pageants. There's even a baby crying competition. But here, there's something different. It's a cat contest here in Istanbul. It's the first time ever. As a cat lover, I'm very excited. Let's go check it out. Turkish breeders. Actually the Federation is three months old. This is the first show. There was a very good response from the people all over the world and we are planning next year more shows actually, maybe three. So right now I'm with Yi, she's come all the way from Malaysia. She's going to take us through what the grooming process is before she goes to the judges. So take us through Yi. Um, usually before the show, uh, we will try to groom the cat. Um, before, uh, because we're coming here by flight, so we have to groom him, uh, degrease all the oil, then we shampoo him and uh, prepare him, blow him, then before come here. So um, when we reach the show hall, because uh, long hours flight, um, we make sure that uh, he's in good condition. I am an all-breed judge for the Cat Fancies Association. As you take the cat out of the cage, you, are, you start judging because you feel the cat, the weight, how the coat feels, you're looking at everything, do they have the proper eye shape, and then once you've got it on the table, you can judge it further, examine it. And this is a rag doll, so they should have a nice vivid blue oval eye. The richer the eye color, the better. Almost purple is, is the best. This cat has a nice strong chin, very gentle curve of that profile, nice ear set, not too high, not too low, according to the breed standard. Should have a silky coat. This cat is probably a little bit older, so his coat has darkened. This nice, solid body. This has very nice eye color, nice, rich blue. Yeah. step to my goal. So this kitten was born in my country. She's a four and a half months right now. And I'm very happy to have her. And uh, this breed is amazing. I recommend to everybody. I'm saying if you feel that you miss anything in your life, 100% you miss ragdoll. <laughs> 